Investors typically use stop orders to close out of an existing position. Stop orders are intended to either lock in profits or limit losses. Alternatively, a stop order can be created to force the investor into a fresh position when a specified price is reached. In this case, the investor has determined that they either want to go long if prices rise above a specific price, or establish a new short position should prices fall below a specified threshold. The stop price serves as a trigger, which will activate the order when penetrated. A stop order becomes marketable and is intended to fill, regardless of price, once the determined trigger price is pierced. It does not have a specific execution price and may execute significantly away from its stop price. In that regard, it is not possible to estimate the impact of executing away from the trigger or stop price until the trade is filled. Please note, however, that stop orders are not guaranteed to execute since they may not get triggered. The order panel in IBKR Desktop can be populated by either clicking on a symbol in the portfolio or watchlist screens, or by typing in a symbol in the search bar. Once the symbol is selected, the investor can click Buy or Sell to create the order window. In this example, the investor chooses to create a sell stop order to close out an existing position in Meta if the stock goes below a certain price. The investor right-clicks on Meta in the portfolio and selects Close Position to populate the order ticket with the position and have it set to Sell. Directly below are three order types, Limit, Market and Stop. The investor chooses Stop and then can adjust the stop price in the line below. The stop price is the price at which the order will be triggered and become marketable. Next, the investor selects the time in force by clicking on the box. They can select day or good till cancelled, known as GTC. In this scenario, the investor would like to keep the stop order active past the current trading session, so they select GTC. For more information on these terms, please see the IBKR Traders Glossary. When the investor is satisfied with the order inputs, they can either click on Preview to see a breakdown of the order as well as its effect on margin, Save to save the order to be transmitted later, or Submit Sell Order to send the order. The investor chooses Submit Sell Order and the order confirmation screen appears. Once satisfied, they click Transmit to send the order. Once sent, if not filled, the investor can view trades Modify the order, cancel order from the order confirmation screen. A stop order is an instruction to submit a buy or sell market order if and when the user specified stop trigger price is attained or penetrated. A stop order is not guaranteed a specific execution price and may execute significantly away from its stop price.